Hello everybody, it's the Android Gamer, and I'm back with Gabriel Knight, Sins of the Father. Uh, so I was able, to, in between these episodes, I was able to get the message right in the graveyard. I was able to go back and redo day four and then play up from there. So now the message is right, and we have the tracker in the grave, or in the coffin. So now let's go to the bayou. <clears throat> See if we can figure out where we're going. Okay. Something in the bayou air is confusing Gabriel's sense of direction. He could use some less susceptible assistance. Let's get the tracker in. This device is called a tracker. Gabriel remembers a time when he and Mosley used it illegally with a couple of babes and a white convertible. Mm -hmm. It operates as follows. The signal device attaches to an object such as a car. Of course. The signal device emits a signal that appears on the tracker LED, allowing the object to be tracked. Gabriel pulls out the tracking device, hoping that the Sake Madeleine made it to the ritual and that this thing will work. All right, there's a blip. They must be here okay, with the Sake so Madeleine. Straight. Left. And up. circles the entrance to the clearing is marked with voodoo skulls at okay. <laughs> Welcome, Brother Crocodile. Please join the other celebrants. Yes, Dr. John. Uh, Brother Eagle. But first... Name the great serpent who crushes all in his coils. Dambala. You are mm -hmm. correct, Brother Crocodile. Who is the destroyer of men? Uh, I think that's all Dambala. Dambala. Nope. You are no believer. You must that die for wrong. violating our sacred circle. I really don't want to be dead. Let's try that Can again. We try that again. I feel like I might be dying a couple of times, so my apologies if it happens. Yeah, goes nothing. <laughs> I have no idea I even skipped this either. <clears throat> Welcome, Brother Crocodile. Please join the other celebrants. Yes, Dr. John. Uh, Brother Eagle. But first. Name the great serpent Dambala. who crushes all... Dambala. You are correct, Brother Crocodile. Who is the destroyer of men? Ogun Badagri. 
You are correct, Brother Crocodile. Enjoy yourself well tonight. <laughs> okay. <gasps> Don't take off the mask. You took off the mask. Find them. No, come back. <laughs> Not at the end of that day, which I kind of figured, but. Okay, right, let me pause and I will be right back and we'll move on to day seven. Okay. <clears throat> Day seven. Me and my last ally lay in waste. I run towards the light. I pray for one to change my path, to give me strength to fight. Didn't come to the door. Grace didn't come to the door. Oh, there she is. Gabriel, Gabriel, wake up. Ow, my head. Oh, it's about time. I've been trying to wake you up for hours. There's no time to lose. I had another dream. It wasn't a dream, believe me. Now come on, get dressed. Wait a minute. I'm starting to remember something about Malia. She's the head priestess of the voodoo cartel. They're responsible for the murders. They've been doing it for years. Malia? Last night, she was the leopard. Like in my dreams, Grace. I know. Those dreams were a warning. Now come on, get dressed. But last night, Malia changed. She became someone, something else. And then I blacked out, I think. How did I get home? I followed you last night. I knew you were going to try to sneak into a ceremony. Lucky for you that I did. If you'd been left at that circle last night, I don't know what she would have done to you. You're wrong. Molly wouldn't hurt me. What about Tetelo? Tetelo. They were chanting that last night. That's the name from Gunther's journal, the woman who took the talisman. Yes, Gabriel, it's your destiny you're facing. You can't just blunder your way through this or you'll end up dead. You have to call your great uncle in Germany. He knows more about this than we do. Okay, I'll call him. But Malia isn't responsible for those things, Grace. <laughs> it's that spirit, that Loa. It's Tetelo. Yeah, possession is convenient that way. Call Wolfgang, Gabriel. I'll be in the shop. Okay. Call Wolfgang. Keep saying that. Didn't Grace say you had to dial zero one one first to get in? Three, four, three. 
This is Gabriel Knight. Can I speak to Wolfgang, please? Yeah, Herr Knight. Ein Moment, bitte. Gabriel, it's so good to hear your voice. I had such a dream last night. There's a good reason for that, Uncle Wolfgang. Mm -hmm. We need to talk. Gabriel fills in Wolfgang on the events of the previous evening. It's even worse than I thought. We have to talk about what I should do. What can you tell me about voodoo? My library contains many books on the occult and religions, and I have read about some particularly evil voodoo and cults. <laughs> no, that. But you, at this point, have more direct experience than I. What do you know about the voodoo murders? I only know what you have told me. They seem to be very similar to the killings in Gunther's journal. Do you know anything about yeah. snakes? I have not studied the subject. I have an intense dislike for them. Do you know what Cabri Sankal means? No. What does it mean? It means goat without horns. It's a term used for human sacrifice in voodoo. Well, let's hope we can avoid any more of that in this family. On. What can you tell me about St. John's Eve? I'm afraid I've never heard of it. So why do you have all this here? Do you know anything about Marie Laveau? No, I'm afraid not. I've heard rumors of a secret houndfall here in New Orleans. Yeah, I am sure they have a temple there. Would probably a very elaborate one. You should not go near it though. Not alone. Do you know anything about animal masks? Yeah, Tetanus people wear animal masks for their rituals, don't they? It is not at all uncommon. Many occult groups are based heavily on animal totems. Animals have such pure, primal traits. Spirituality, good or bad, is about reaching these pure levels. Aggressive and cunning like the snake. Agile and nurturing like the monkey. Even our family is associated then. with the image of a lion. Do you know anything about Veves? It is a visual symbol of one or more Loa. Each Loa has its own sign which is used to summon it. Have you ever heard of Dambala? Dambala is a snake. He, he is a Loa. A voodoo god. Yes, he's one of the primary Loa of the Getty tribe. Okay. Ah, I see. Good work. That information might prove useful. Does Ogun Balagri mean anything to you? It is a voodoo Loa, is it not? Yes. A particularly nasty one, so I understand. Have you come across anything about it in your research? Okay, we'll just go with the yellows. No, might as well. That's all I know. Almost done them. Do you know anything about Before Black Voodoo? Discuss that. My library contains many books on the occult and religions, and I have read about some okay. particularly evil Voodoo cults. But you, at this point, have more direct. What can you tell me about Schottenjägers? Of course, I sometimes forget how little you know of the family, Gabriel. I never understood how Heinz could allow his sons to remain ignorant. But now is not the time for that discussion. Schottenjäger is really two words in English, Gabriel. Schotten means shadow, and Jäger means hunter. Shadow hunter? Yes, mm -hmm. shadow hunter. We Ritters have been shot in Jaegers for many centuries. No one is sure when it began or how, but we have records of ancestors as early as the 13th century fulfilling this role. Some believe that the role was given us when... Ah, but such fantasies cannot be of use to you at the moment, Gabriel. Most people are completely blind to the fact that evil does exist. 
Shadows of darkness, spirits, I don't know about that. Which, I mean, I mean, yes, for the most public, they don't play that in the field, but there's always some that are skeptical about that. But we know they exist, Gabriel, and we hunt them. How do we hunt them? And why? Why? Because it is our duty. As for how, that is something you will have to learn. But it's not easily explained over the phone. Tell me about Tetelo. Well, from your description of the ritual last night, I'd say that Gunther's mistress, Tetelo, is now the primary Loa for the Getty tribe. It seems she still controls them by possessing her female descendants and speaking through them. <clears throat> you remember in Gunther's journal he said that Tetelo was possessed by her father's Loa during the killings in Charleston. This sounds similar, but Tetelo has obviously become a much more powerful Lova than her father ever was. Talisman? Probably because of the added power of the Talisman. Let's talk about the Talisman. I myself have only seen it in old sketches and paintings, and in my dreams. It was in the family for centuries before Tetelo took it. It is believed to be as old as the role of Schottenjäger itself. But it does. The talisman has genuine power. I hmm. don't know how or why, but it is so. The Schottenjäger swore to use the power for good, never for evil, for defense, not offense. We've been searching for the talisman for years. It's a terrible thing to know that something powerful that was entrusted to us is in the wrong hands. With the talisman, Tetelo has all the power and we none. The only possible way to fight her is to regain the talisman. Then we will at least be on more equal footing. How can we regain the talisman? The talisman is probably buried with Tetelo's remains. That's what gives her Loa so hey, much power. Find remains. To find the talisman, we must find her remains. How would we find Tetelo's remains? Ah, we have pondered that question a long time, we Ritters. There are two probabilities. The first is that her remains are with the tribe in New Orleans. The other is that the remains were returned to a sacred place near the tribe's original homeland. We've tried to locate Ketelo's African homeland, but Gunther says so little in his journal about her tribe. And slaving records are practically non-existent. As for the other idea, we okay. had no clue that Tetelo's people were in New Orleans until now. Let's discuss the possible African homeland. All right. Have you learned anything that might help us locate it? I spoke with the Professor Hartridge. Unfortunately for him, he thinks the tribe's name was Agree, and that they live near the Fawn tribe in what's now called the People's Republic of Benin. This is incredible, Gabriel. I must go research this new information in my library right now. Wait, what should I do? Stay low. If you get a chance, you might look into the possibility that Tetelo's remains are somewhere in New Orleans. But don't try to broach their private areas <laughs> without my assistance, Gabriel. Oh, you will make a fine shot in Jaeger, but only if you are not dead. Um, sure. I'll wait. Goodbye, then, Gabriel. And remember, okay. if you need a place of safety, come to Schloss Ritter. No. Got a minute, Grace? What's up? Could you do some research? Sure, what? I can't think. Have you ever heard of a Schottenjäger? No. Is that a voodoo word? I don't think so. You. It's German. No, sorry. I don't speak German. Okay. Let's see what we can say. Let's just do... Not the 
by you and track this player. No, what? Yeah, I did that. To look for those remains. To go to Germany. Did you complete the initiation ceremony? I think Germany is at the end of this day, probably. his wallet and pay for a trip. <laughs> okay. I guess I go break into his office again. Let's do that first before I go to the graveyard. For a bit. Be careful. Where's Mosley's place? I'm not going back in there. Okay, let's go through here then. A small marble plate near the tomb doors. The plate is up. Beneath the plate is a button. Push the button, Gabriel. Gabriel hears the faint sound of breaking glass. Um. think they'd be alive. It's a lit button. Oh, it's going back out. I just want to see what the rest of this says, even though we already did it. Don't know why it's still here for this day. All the blip. It's pitch black. Looks like the light bulb is broken. You need to bring your own light with you. Okay.
Oh, well, that's good enough. That's the diary, right? Yes. Gunter Ritter's diary. I'm talking about to go through this again. <laughs> hey, Grace, here I am. Oh boy, party time. Oh, there's a flashlight. Need a flashlight. Gabriel got the flashlight free in the mail when he ordered a magazine you subscription. Say that. It works though, at the moment. This wall is covered with decorated skulls. In Ossiary Shrine to some of the Getty ancestors. Oh, let's start pulling open stuff. The drawer's interior contains mostly dust and bones. Oh, that's cool. Like that lens flare. Don't get personal. Okay. The drawer is locked. So clearly that's the one. The plaque under drawer has an etching of the Veve on it, but no name. Gabriel can't take the drawers. Did they all say it's a picture of the Veve? The drawer is locked. Okay. The plaque under drawer has a so name etched on it. Zevi again. See if there's anything else in here. How do I open it? Must be a key around here somewhere amongst the dead. Okay. Gabriel has a feeling it wouldn't be wise to screw around unduly in this tomb. Stop that. And broke the bulb. Mm. 
Gabriel has a feeling it wouldn't be wise to screw around unduly in this tomb. Gabriel doesn't see anything there. I think I know what happened to the men in the family now. Huh. Some of these look loose. Haha. <laughs> Thank you for the hey, there. One of the drawers popped up. Developers. <laughs> Flashlight. Huh? <clears throat> Ouch. On oh, my head. What the hell was that? Well, mostly was there. That's how he gave his wallet. Mosley's body is gone. <laughs> it's a man's wallet. worried about you for good reason apparently what happened do you need a doctor nothing you want to know about and no you're some aspirin gabriel this is nuts you have to get out of new orleans no kidding well listen wolfgang called while you were out he said and i quote tell gabriel that i found what i was looking for it's time for me to do my duty schloss ritter is his now now call me crazy but i don't think that's good news not for uncle wolfie no what are you gonna do if I figure it out, I'll let you know. No, nope, there's nothing new. Okay. Got a minute, Greg? Let's What's up? go into the room. Gabriel can't see a way to use that. Gabriel opens the wallet and finds <laughs> some ID belonging to Mosley and an American's repressed card. <laughs> Mosley's American's repressed card. Credit. What a concept. That doesn't seem to work that way. I think it's I have a them. number for a travel agent on that phone book page if I need to call them. Did I say you had to dial zero one one first to get five, in the For a trip to Riddersburg, Germany. Riddersburg, Germany. Hold on, let me look that up. I can fly you into Munich. That's the closest airport to Riddersburg. 
You can rent a car from there or take the train. Let's see, the best price I can see uh, for the flight is fourteen hundred dollars. What would you like to do? Charge it to my Americans repressed. Yes, sir. And your name was Mosley. <laughs> Feeling a little guilty. Gabriel gives the travel agent Mosley's card number and is informed that he can pick okay. up his tickets at the Norlands International Airport. Let's go talk to Grace. A minute, right? What's up? Guess what? I'm going to Germany. Really? That's great. But how on earth can you afford? A man's got to do what a man's got to do. Oh my God! <laughs> I wouldn't like the sound of that, even if you were a man. I'll miss you too, Grace. Anything? Tell me about yourself, Grace. What do you want to know? Just tell me anything at all. I came to New Orleans because I'd read so much about it. I thought spending a few months here would okay. clear my head. No. Let's see what's in the paper today. Before I head Today's out. News. Dated June 24th, 1993. Not. There's nothing about the voodoo murder case in the paper today. Gabriel finds a humorous tidbit under the Life is Stranger Than Fiction column. Apparently, there were reports of ghosts in the Bayou mm -hmm. St. John last night. Various people called the newspaper with stories about hearing strange noises and seeing weird lights over the swamp. Some folks claim it's a ghost of Marie Laveau. The paper relates it to similar delusions that crop up every Halloween. Gabriel knows better. Gabriel's horoscope today reads, Wise is the warrior who knows when to fight <laughs> and when to get the hell out of Dodge. Don't help me, I'm actually starting to listen to this guy. Okay. Gabriel picks up his tickets at the airport and boards a plane. Off we go. Not bad card. Is Nye, Gabriel Nye. Herr Knight. Gabriel Knight. Oh, Gabriel. Kommen Sie bitte herein. I mean, come in, please, Herr Knight. I was not expecting you. Has Wolfgang sent you here? Uncle Wolfgang? No, I came to see him. Isn't he here? No, he is gone. I'm sorry. You came all this way. No, oh, great. That's all I need. Herr Knight, Wolfgang told me all about you and gave me instructions yes. for you to feel welcome here. Please, this is your home. You are a retter, no? I'm just doing some work. I will continue and you may make yourself comfortable. If there's anything you need, please ask me. You may use Wolfgang's bedroom. It is at the top of the stairs. Thank you, miss. You may call me Gerda, her night. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, we are in Germany now. Uh, to figure out my lineage as a shadow hunter and try to find my uncle and see what help he can help me back in, in New Orleans. And as always, this is the Android Gamer, Lair Days, and happy gaming!